Welcome to Selenium Master Test Automation Crash Course Selenium Python Web Driver Lesson 3 Selenium Builder Section Installation and Test Script Creation Selenium Builder a Firefox add-on that lets you easily create Selenium tests. For more examples and instructions, you can visit the website seleniumbuilder.github.io slash sebuilder. Using Selenium Builder, you can enter a URL and start recording. You can click user actions you want to test. You can run tests locally or on Selenium server. This plugin is very similar to the plugin Selenium IDE. But this plugin can be used for dynamic data input for your test script. In this lesson, I will teach you how to install this plugin and create a simple test script. You can install the Selenium Builder plugin directly clicking on the install button on your Firefox browser and create automation scripts. However, the latest version is missing the functionality to run your tests locally. So for this test, I will install another version. To install the version 2.5, you visit the website https colon slash slash github.com slash selenium builder slash se builder slash tree slash gh dash pages. On this URL, you can download the version. 2.5 You scroll down until you see selenium dash builder dash latest XPI Builder version is 2.3.5 So you click on the link to download and on this download page, you click on the download button. So now this Firefox add-on is downloaded on your PC. After downloading, I saved the file on the desktop. The file name is selenium dash builder dash latest dot xpi now let's install this plugin on firefox i open mozilla firefox browser click on the navigation bar and press alt f keys to open up the menu and from file menu choose open file Go to desktop, now choose selenium-builder-latest.xpi file, click on the open button. So this said, this site would like to install an unverified add-on in Firefox, proceed at your own risk. So I click on the install button. 
Now Selenium Builder will be installed after you restart Firefox. So restart now. So here I type in http colon slash slash demo dot mahara dot org. So this site is loaded. Now I press Alt F, go to Tools menu, and choose Web Developer. And from this Web Developer, I select Launch Selenium Builder. So now Selenium Builder window is displayed. Selenium Builder provides two types of script creation, Selenium 1, Selenium 2. So we use Selenium 2 because which is very popular in terms of Selenium commands and syntax. So let's click on Selenium 2. Now this is in recording mode. Now let's start recording and create a simple automation script for login and logout test cases. So username, I type in admin and for password, I type in Mahara demo. Now click on the login button. So let's add a verification for the logout link. So record a verification and choose the logout. Now I click on the logout link and choose another verification, record a verification and choose login button. Now the test script is created. I click on stop recording. So as you see on this screen, Selenium Builder already created steps for the logout and login test cases. So get command used for opening the website. Set element text is used for typing in username and set element text used for typing in the password. Now click element for clicking on the login button. Verify text present. This will be used for verifying the text after logging in. And click element link text log out. And then after logging out, we will see the login button. Now let's run the script and observe the result. So here I click on the run and this run menu provides several functions. Run tests locally, run on Selenium server, run suite locally, run suite on Selenium server, share state across suite, run on source on demand, run suite on source on demand. So let's run test locally and observe the test result. So now I click on run test locally. So the background is green. This means the test passed. Now let's 
run the test again. So I click on clear results and click on the run menu and choose run test locally. So this login and login test script is completed and test result is successful. So this is how you can install Selenium Builder and create test automation scripts.